and he was working in a multinational company and uh, at the end of the day evening he came back and i was there at home and he said that uh, my friend uh, you are a naturopathy doctor and i know this line of medicine and you know i don't want to pop a pill and is there any solution that you could suggest me and uh, you could tell me that i could uh, you know get relieved of this headache or uh, burnout or exhaustion what i have feeling at this point of time and uh, what i asked him is that if he has a hot water fill a bucket of hot water at least uh, two third of it and immerse your leg in the hot water and don't sit under the fan that is what i said to him and we say it as hot foot immersion so immersing your leg in the hot water and sitting uh, you know relaxed uh, not under fan uh, you can sit outside also no issue in your garden or in your balcony uh, at at least for 10 to 15 minutes in the duration uh, what happens is that during this period of time uh, some people usually you know sweat and uh, they feel relieved and say they feel relaxed the other way this is one way to uh, reduce the burnout and he was so happy that uh, till date he says me that uh, as you have said uh, that is what i am following till date and uh, that is the best hack which you have told me ever since you know uh, i have known about uh, managing my own burnout or exhaustion by the end of the day and that is why if you have seen most of the influencers also uh, around the social media they say that uh, you know take a hot bath before you go to sleep because it makes you feel relaxed no no so sleep that is one thing a hot foot immersion the other thing is that uh, ice uh, you know pack and uh, applying it around your neck for uh, just 2 uh, to 3 uh, minutes uh, and rubbing it across your uh, head behind the head neck especially uh, the tension is loaded around your uh, trapezius muscle also sometimes that also helps in relieving your uh, stress or exhaustion that is one way that people uh, can manage their burnouts at the end of the day and um, one more thing which i wanted to add is that you know usually uh, once you come back home in the ancient times uh, our grandmothers or parents used to tell us that you know go wash your face and legs and hand and come back as soon as it becomes evening 6 o'clock once they are back from work and all and uh, that's a, this has been very uh, you know beneficial and uh, if you see uh, you go to any wellness center or resorts or uh, you know a business class flight what they give you is the hot towel so that you can rub yourself or even those uh, wet wipes also it makes you feel kind of relieved you know you feel a bit of energized you feel like a re- you know refreshed same way even if you are in office what can i do most of the people ask me this also doctor see you are telling it right uh, but i can't do the hot foot immersion when i am in office i can't take a ice pack and apply it when i am in office so what is the best way i can manage so what i tell them tell them is that you know go to the boss station and you know wash your face with uh, cold water or the normal tap water because that helps you relieve so much of stress itself it makes you feel uh, you know relaxed and energized so water has its own benefits either it is hot and cold both have its own benefits and utilize it as a hack itself i could suggest that you know you can even uh, you know wet your uh, your chief when you are in uh, this one uh, you know you at your work and utilize it to rub uh, around your face and neck and all the other parts of the you know of, uh, neck and the back of the neck and all those things so that is much more more of most of the beneficial part which you can inculcate and these are the two things which you can you know understand how your body is trying to talk to you the reason why your headache is because as i explained it in detail and the reason why your body is feeling uh, you know acidic is also one of the reason which i explained and i hope these two things uh, helps you in understanding the how your body is trying to communicate with you